The NBA on TNT comes to you from the First Union Center in Philadelphia as Michael Jordan brings his struggling Washington Wizards to the city of brotherly love. With athletic ability and his strength. Nick, give me. All right, 18 points last night and 31 minutes, the second fewest he has played this year. And uh, Doug Collins making a conservative effort with the team playing uh, the second of four games in five nights to limit it to the mid-30s. Well, this was all expected before the season started. The talent base is weak. We know that they have a lot of backup players if you're talking about a... And Michael Jordan hits the first shot on the turnaround. Now that was beautiful. Here is Iverson. And uh, Whitney defending against Iverson. Good pass inside to Hartring, who lays it in. Because he is very strong and very energetic. He's going to pick up a lot of garbage. Michael Jordan. That's the Jordan of old with that line, ride, line drive shot in uh, which the uh, twine hardly moves. And the Wizards lead 6-4. to four. Jordan shooting 40% from the field. Did not go to the line last night, and he's been over 80% from there. Allen Iverson connects on his first shot of the game. The Wizards beat the 76ers 90-76 to back in November. They didn't have Philadelphia Allen Iverson, who now has five points. Run it out with a three-point lead, nice. and here is Iverson with the jumper. Iverson is hot. He has seven points. Post game. And Michael, we said, is the only one who is the, oh, is this guy on fire? Iverson is feeling it. He has 10 points now, hitting his second three of the game in this crowd. And Hubie chronicled their outstanding defense down the line in our open. Here is Iverson. He's been hot and remains so. Iverson now, a two-point basket, now has 12 points on five for six from the field. And it's won by the 76ers and Iverson hitting the three. Allen Iverson now with 15 points. Super drive. The big factor is the fadeaway J. The perimeter game is going for him. He has the defender rocking back and he's just shooting it in your face. Eight attempts, six field goals, three for three behind the arc. Solid performer. The personal foul was on Teron Liu. Two free throws by Allen Iverson, who has 17 first quarter points. He blocks Maywood's shot, and here comes uh, Allen Iverson firing away and hitting. I don't even think Allen Iverson took a look at that basket before he let it go. Ruffin. Ruffin does a good hustle job, allowing Iverson to hit from the corner. A two point basket, and Davis looking for Michael Jordan, who's sandwiched. Fall away by Jordan. Tough shot at any age. And Michael Jordan now with six. Harpering trying to stay with Jordan. Very pesky defender is Harpering. And Jordan goes right through everybody. A picture move by Michael Jordan, who has been into the game. Keep an eye on Michael now as he gets into the middle of the floor. See, right here, he gives you a little hesitation, right? And then he makes the big move, stepping right on through. And Jordan with 10 points. Iverson defended by Teron Liu. The clear out. A reprise of last year's NBA Finals, and Iverson beats into the basket for his 23rd point. Standing talent because he can catch. The main thing is, is can he score? Because again, it's a one-point lead for the 76ers. Here's Iverson, and Iverson coming up, and it's now... And here's Jordan backing in against Aaron McKee, and hits the jumper, a line drive at 12.5 a game. Well, and then the ball handling ability to change for Washington. Jordan picks up the bobble and hits the shot. No matter, Michael Jordan now with 20 points for Michael Jordan. And they've been running that at Zonham legit. Jordan driving against Harpering. He got a step on Matt Harpering. And Michael Jordan with his first basket of the third quarter, now with 23. And Jordan very nearly lost his footing, recovers and hits the basket. 25 for Michael Jordan. Here's Iverson, who does not have a field goal here in the third quarter, and now he does. His first brings the Sixers to within four. Allen Iverson and Michael Jordan 
have lived up to their billing. They have not disappointed, and 55 points between them. And Lou and Iverson follows. So Speedy is guarded by Raja Bell with eight on the shot clock. And there's Jordan. And now it's a eight-point game. Has been games in which the Wizards are close or ahead down the stretch. But Iverson hits the two. Iverson with 34 now. Plenty of time on the clock. Iverson firing. Steps back against Teron Liu. Allen Iverson on the shot clock. Here's Jordan. In the low post, the turnaround by Michael. 29 for Jordan. And a nine-point lead again for the Wizards. They want the clock to move quickly. They've had few wins. Iverson. And Iverson now with 38 points, matching the season's high. 92 to 85. And here is Iverson fighting for the offensive rebound and tips it in finally. Season's high for Iverson of 40. Allen Iverson, a season's high 40 points in a losing cause. As the Wizards go to 4 and 10, the Sixers drop to 500 at 7 and 7. Our thanks to our statistician, Marty Aronoff, once again our final score, Wizards 94, Sixers 87. So for Hubie Brown and Craig Sager, our producer Jay Hoover, director Lonnie Dale, Rodney Vaughn, Jeff Harris, Gregson Frampton, and the rest of our TNT crew, I'm Dick Stockton. Good night from Philadelphia. We'll send you to Inside the NBA with Ernie Johnson after this break.